Yeah, so here we are at Hotel Villa Mexicana, and uh, this is a great place. Look, it's got loads of cool things. First of all, it's right at the start of the Copper Canyon Valley, and it's in the middle of, well, it's not in the middle of town, it's just out of town, about a three or four minute walk out of town, and it's really chilled and relaxed. And as you see, it's got fire pit to sit around in the evening. It's got some nice cabins and the cabins have done out really well. Um, and you can see right in the middle of the beautiful scenery here. Uh, it's got all the, um, all the mod cons. It's got a laundrette, it's got a bar, it's got a restaurant, it's got a shop. It's got hookup points for your caravan or tourer and different sized cabins depending on what you need and it's got some with kitchens built into them some that sleeps four or six people and some small ones here for more budget economy travel type things but the thing that i can say is that it's really chilled out and laid back Let's have a little look around here we go So this is good, isn't it? We've got our own log cabin. Look. Log cabin. It's pretty good. It's lovely. It is lovely, actually. It's got a swingy chair. Oh, it's got a swingy chair. That's Tanya happy, then. Swingy chair. We've got a bathroom. We've got a bath. And a shower, obviously. Obviously a shower. But look at this, this is cool. I mean, look at it from this way. Bit of aircon, television, two big beds. Fridge, coffee maker, coffee stuff. And then outside. Down there, they've got a shop. Shop, reception. And a restaurant attached to it and there's a few people in there eating and it looks like I haven't had a look at the menu yet but it just looks like steak and chips and things like that so you know I bet I bet they do tacos my god I bet they do do tacos as well but it's okay it's cool there you go here's our little cabin look it's got a little bay window on the front of it there we go but listen, not very much noise going on there at all. Villa Mexicana, or Villa Mexicana, here in Creel, at the start of the Copper Canyon Trail, really. Yeah, okay, cool. I'm really hungry. I'm gonna go and eat. And then I'm going to look in that bath. And I'm going to have a bath if it's any good. That's what I'm really looking forward to. Oh, right. breakfast time. Catch you soon. What have we got then? Bye. Well, we've ordered eggs. And we've got eggs and beans with some cheese on. And we've got some toast. And we've got a good amount mm -hmm. of coffee. And... Chilli. <laughs> and some... Yeah, of course. We've got some chilli sauce kind of thing. And it's a, it's a lovely day out here. There's Tanya. Say hello, Tanya. Morning. Beautiful sunny day. And... Uh, yeah. We're going to go out trekking in a little while. Just got to do some video editing first. <laughs> but, um, yeah, trekking shortly. Okay, cool. Right, I'm going to eat this breakfast because it looks good. So here we are. This is the clubhouse, I guess you'd call it. It's the bar restaurant. Come down here for breakfast in the morning. They do a cracking breakfast. They've got a nice little bar. They've got a shop as well, which sells all the things that you need. And they've got a kids' play area here. And the building behind the kids' play area here is conference centre. And then over here, they've got points to hook up your caravan or tour camper van, whatever you want to call them, to the water and the electric. So there we go. 
Let's have a look around. Right in the middle of the valley, look at the scenery. Look at the scenery. I wish I'd brought my rock climbing gear with me. And then you're about a three minute walk, four minute walk, out of the gate, turn right out of the gate, down into the town centre or village centre. And in the village, there's loads of little restaurants and bars, and there's a micro brewery and things like that. So, if you want somewhere to come, chill out for a few days, Villa Mexicana, here in Creel, don't miss out, it's great fun. So they also offer uh, Copper Canyon tours and it's a great place to base yourself if you want to go walking around in the valley and uh, do the other tours, waterfall tours and adventure, adventure pursuits you could call it. Yeah, not bad at all, very good.